Hey guys, what's up? It's uh, Kevin from Strict Strength here. And uh, hey guys, it's Kevin from Strict Strength here. I got uh, some great stretches. Hey guys, it's Kevin from Strict Strength here. I got some great stretches for you today. Help open up those hips a little bit and uh, hopefully help you get your splits. All right, so to start out, we're just gonna do some like basic movement stuff um, to kind of loosen up. Uh, so let's take a wide stance here. And then we're gonna do kind of like a sumo style squat. So you're just gonna sink down into it like so, pushing those knees out wide. You can kind of move side to side here. And then what we're gonna do is try to go to one side, uh, but try to keep this foot flat. And try, if you can, try, try to keep your chest somewhat upright as well. It helps to use this arm to kind of like push this knee out wide. All right, and then all the way over to the other side. All right, let's go back center. Awesome, and then we're gonna turn one direction. Let's take a lunge. And then what we're gonna try to do here on our lunge is without actually changing the elevation, I'll try to do it this way so it's easier to see, without changing the elevation of your head, you're gonna straighten out your back knee and then bring it back down to the ground. And you're just doing a few reps there. You'll probably feel it in this pocket here. What we don't wanna do is like, up and down lunge, all right? So again, you're here, straighten your leg, feel a stretch, tap the knee. All right, and let's go back over to the other side. So same thing, we take that lunge, maybe scoot that foot in a little bit if you need to, without changing your elevation, try to straighten your leg, tap the knee, Let's do two more. And good. All right, shake that out a little bit. All right, let's go and have a seat here. So we're gonna do kind of like a hip opening series. Um, so first thing we're gonna do is bring this foot on top of the knee, and then you're gonna try to actually pin this leg to your chest if you can. So. Let me see if I can spin here so it's easier to see. So I'm trying to really just pin that nice and close to my body. All right, and then what I'm gonna do, I'll spin back over this way. I'm gonna take this and just drop it down and then we're gonna rotate. Just nice, easy twist here. Okay, and then this next one, what I'm gonna to try to do is stack my knees and feet the best you can, all right? So depending on your flexibility. Some people end up kind of stuck here with this knee up. Um, if that's the case, just gentle pressure down. If it feels okay, you're gonna try to settle in, stack knees and feet here. And then if you're, not, if you're still not feeling much, then what we're gonna do is actually lean into it. And again, you can kind of focus on trying to pin that leg to your chest. And then just kind of relaxing into it. Let's take a couple more breaths here. All 
Mm -hmm. Relax and come on up. All right. And then we're going to just kind of repeat that same series with the other side. So we'll bring that foot up. You try to bring it in close. Pin it to your chest. Excellent. All right. And then we're going to let this foot drop down. We're going to rotate. On this rotation, I feel it uh, actually pulling the mic cord. So I'm trying to keep it from pulling off here. <laughs> All right, and then we're going to stack the knees and feet. Should still be good. If we end up with no audio at the end of this video, there's a problem. <laughs> All right, so stacking the knees and feet here. Again, if you're floating, light pressure. If you're feeling good, we'll lean into it. Bring it down. Trying to melt down low into it. Just relax, a couple deep breaths on your exhale, you just try to sink in. And relax, awesome job you guys. All right, so today let's go over some front split stuff. So hips kind of be a little bit more loose. Um, the, for the front splits, a lot of the same stuff. Um, we might just give you a few variations on it. Um, so first thing, let's just take our lunge, like so. Nothing too fancy. Just kind of feeling it out. And then what I like to do is actually pull this back knee off the ground. And then you can think of like squeezing this uh, back hip or glute really tight. And then you'll feel that more in your hip flexor. So we're going to contract for about 10 seconds. And then relax. That should feel like it loosened up just a little bit. All right, and then we're going to straighten out both legs here. You can play around with adjusting your hips a little bit. Usually you want to try to square them off. So like here would be like a little bit more open. Here I'm a little bit more squared off. And then you can also do like stuff like Walk your hands around, see if that changes your stretch at all. You can try to like flatten out your back. Feels pretty good. Um, maybe we do like a open up or a reach. You can also go for a wrap. You bring this hand down, you try to loop it onto your quad. Go and slide on down a little bit further into our lunge. And then let's slide on down into our front split or your best attempt. Relax. All right. And then we're going to switch it up, other side. So first thing we're going to do is just a lunge to feel it out. Let's straighten out that back knee. And then again, you want to think like squeeze this glute really tight. I feel that a lot deeper in that hip flexor. 
about 10 seconds. And then back down, just kind of like feel it, see if it feels any looser. And then we're going to straighten out that front leg. And then we want to square the hips off, try not to just open up this way, square them off. And play around with some of that same stuff. Walk our hands a little bit. And then back. Try to straighten out the spine, even if it's just momentarily, and then kind of like sink into it. We can try our open up. Practice your balance. We'll try that wrap. Quad. Relax. Now let's slide it down into kind of our stretched out lunge here. Whew, feeling good. We got a whole bunch of videos in this series, um, so you know, feel free to check them all out. We'll put them all into a, into like a playlist for you guys so they're easy to find. And uh, hopefully you're following all 14 days here, but, you know, feel free to, you know, revisit them in the future. Or maybe you're watching this and it is the future, and in which case, uh, check out all of our videos for some great content. All right, let's slide this down into... Our front split. Definitely my front split on this side is not as good as my other side. But that's all right. It's a work in progress. Got to start somewhere. It's a little bit longer here. And relax. Awesome. All right, let's go ahead and have a seat. We'll just kind of finish this off a little butterfly stretch. Um, so we want to try to bring our feet in nice and close. Like so. You're going to drop your knees out pretty wide here. Uh, a lot of people usually kind of like knees floating up here. If that's the case, you know, you try and press one side at a time or both sides down. And then eventually we're going to try to get both knees down where we can sit nice and tall. And then from there, we can take that forward fold, um, all dependent on your mobility, of course. If you're comfortable with it, you can kind of like sink into it. And we'll just finish out. We'll hold this for about 20 seconds, and then we'll call it good for today. Awesome job. Uh, we'll be posting videos daily for, I don't know how long, at least the next eight days. Um, so follow along and then we'll try to continue them after that as well. All right. Thanks guys.